Good morning, kids! Welcome to our online class. I am Teacher Frel, your teacher in Math 2. Our lesson for today is about solving multi-step routine and non-routine problems. Most Essential Learning Competencies Solves multi-step routine and non-routine problems involving addition and subtraction of 2 to 3 digit numbers, including money, using appropriate problem-solving strategies and tools. In a multi-step routine and non-routine, you need to perform more than one mathematical operation like addition and subtraction. Here are ways in solving multi-step routine problems. First, understand the problem. Second, find the given numbers. Third, determine what is asked in word problem. Fourth, determine the operation to be used if you need to add or subtract. Fifth, write the number sentence. And six, check your answer. For example, Danilo opened a big basket. There were 125 apples. He put 32 red apples and 15 green apples in a smaller basket. How many apples remain in the big basket? Now let's do the following steps. First step, understand the problem. First question, what is Danilo doing? Correct! He opened a big basket and putting some apples in a smaller basket. Next question, what is in the big basket? Correct! There were 125 apples in the big basket. And the next question, what is he putting together? Correct! He puts 32 red apples and 15 green apples in a smaller basket. Second step, find the given numbers. The given numbers are 125 apples were in a big basket and 32 red apples and 15 green apples in a smaller basket. Third step, what is asked in a problem? Plan what to do. How can you find the answer? You're going to find the total amount of red and green apple. Next is subtract the total amount of red and green apples to the amount of apples in the big basket. Fourth step, what operation to be used? Correct, addition and subtraction. Fifth step, write the number sentence. So the number sentence is 125 minus open and close parentheses 32 plus 15 equals N. Now do the plan or solve to find the answer. Let us do the first step. We're going to add the numbers in the parentheses. 32 plus 15 equals so let's add first the digits in the ones place 2 plus 5 equals 7 then add the digits in the tens place 3 plus 1 equals 4 so the answer is 47 next let's do the second step step 2 we're going to subtract 47 to 125. 125 is the total amount of apples in the big basket. So 125 minus 47 equals first add the digits in the ones place. 5 minus 7 cannot be. Borrow 1 from 2 so 2 become 1 and 5 become 15. 
15 minus 7 equals 8. Then subtract the digits in the tens place. 1 minus 4 cannot be. Borrow 1 from 1, so 1 becomes 0, and 1 becomes 11. 11 minus 4 equals 7. So there were 78 apples remain in the big basket. Step 6. Check your answer. We're going to change the position of 32 and 15. So 15 is in the first position and 32 is in the second position. So 15 plus 32 equals... Let's add the 1's place and then next is the 10's place. 5 plus 2 equals 7. And 1 plus 3 equals 4. So the answer are the same, 47. Then, 125 minus 47 equals 78. We're going to add the subtrahen 47 to the difference, which is 78. So 47 plus 78 equals, add the 1s and then 10s. 7 plus 8 equals 15, carry up 1. 1 plus 4 plus 7 equals 12. So the answer is 125. So as you can see, the mean you went 125 is the same to the sum 125. So the answer is correct. Here are ways in solving multi-step non-routine problems. The first step is understand the problem. Second step, find the given numbers. Third step, determine what is asked in word problem. Fourth step, determine the operation to be used if you need to add or subtract. Fifth step, write the number sentence. And sixth step, check your answer. For example, Janica needs 17 brown eggs and 48 white eggs for her cooking show. She has 90 eggs in her refrigerator. Then her mom gave her another 20 eggs. How many more eggs does she have in all? Let's do the following steps. What is asked in the problem? Correct! How many more eggs does she have in all? Next, what are the given numbers? Correct! The given numbers are 17, 48, 90, and 20. Next, plan what to do. How can you find the answer? Find the total amount of brown and white eggs. And then, subtract the total amount of brown and white eggs to the amount of eggs in her refrigerator. Then add the other eggs her mom gave her. Next, what operation to be used? Correct! Addition and subtraction. And then, write the number sentence. 90 minus, open and close parenthesis, 17 plus 48 plus 20 equals N. Next, solve to find the answer. Step 1. We're going to add 17 plus 48, which are the numbers inside the parentheses. 17 plus 48 equals, add the 1's place and then next is the 10's place. 7 plus 8 equals 15. Carry up 1. 1 plus 1 plus 4 equals 6. So the answer is 65. And then step 2, we're going to subtract 65 to 90. 90 is the amount of eggs in her refrigerator. So 90 minus 65 equals 0 minus 5 cannot be. Borrow 1 from 9. So, 9 becomes 8 and 0 becomes 10. 10 minus 5 equals 5. And 8 minus 6 equals 2. 
So the answer is 25. Now, for step 3, let's add 25 plus 20. 20 is the egg given by her mom. So 25 plus 20 equals 5 plus 0 equals 5. 2 plus 2 equals 4. There were 45 eggs in all. Now answer this activity. Solve the problem and answer the following questions. There were 1,350 desk calendars given as tokens to public schools. 250 desk calendars will be given to the staff and 300 desk calendars will be given to the teachers. The remaining calendars will be given to all the students. How many calendars were left? Answer these questions. Number 1. What is asked in the problem? Number 2. What are the given numbers? Number 3. What mathematical operation to be used? Number 4. Write the number sentence. And number 5. Solve the problem. Kids, did you understand our lessons today? Very good! So again, our lesson today is Solving Multi-Step Routine and Non-Routine Problems. Kids, I hope you enjoy our lessons today. Until our next topic, bye-bye kids!